talk Super Bowl rings, shall we? With five Super Bowl wins under their belt, the 49ers have a rich history. And I got to meet one man who has been there for most of it. Bronco Hinnick of Pleasanton was an equipment manager for the Niners. Recently, he shared some of his memories with me, and he showed me the coveted hardware he's collected over the years. I think they're on the roll. They're the best team. If anyone is more positive about the 49ers and their road to winning a sixth Super Bowl. So that's for the 49er days. It's Pleasanton resident Bronco Hinnick. My dad worked for the Raiders, so I helped him out. That's when he was a kid. Here's the photo. And then he spent the next 30 years in the NFL in his adult years, 16 of those as the equipment manager for the 49ers. And that's me when I was hired. And that's us in their equipment room. That's how small it was. That's in Redwood City. The memories, endless. That's me giving water. Pierce Holt, people would know him. And that's Romo, Romanowski, Washington. This is Candlestick. This is Jerry Rice, mud game, drying off his gloves, which people do, but you also gotta take care of the arms, forearms, chest area. So just paying attention to detail. He joined the San Francisco 49ers in 1984. And here's some photos of uh, Jerry Rice and I. That's before the game, uh, adjusting his pads, helmet. Eye black before the game. Bronco recalls the days of breaking up fights on the field. I'm moving in. I'm moving in. <laughs> they don't listen to me. <laughs> I bet they do. This, this is Charles Haley. And sewing torn jersey pants on the sidelines during a game. I'm on the sideline sewing up back of his pants and many many other stories if you notice Deion Sanders has like six or eight pair of socks that he cut it's so thick I said what are you doing that for he said because I have skinny legs I said any guy in the NFL would trade for your legs that speed he was with the 49ers for 16 playoffs and he was with them for four Super Bowls which comes with four prized possessions he displayed right on his kitchen counter beginning with Super Bowl number two when we played the Dolphins at Stanford let's look at the detail the Golden Gate Bridge with the clouds coming in here's number three coach Walsh won the ring to represent the rim of a stadium, they put team of the 80s. Number four. This is when we went to New Orleans and we played the Denver Broncos, we'd be in 55 to 10. And I told the clubhouse people helping me, go get those boxes with championship hats and t-shirts, pass them out in every locker. I said, well, that's bad luck. I said, luck, nothing to do with this game is over. And number five. And the last Super Bowl, the fifth one, is important. That's when we beat the Chargers. This also has the 49er logo, the 75th anniversary of the league, and then the uh, Super Bowl logo. Do you have a favorite one? I like I like the second Super Bowl at Stanford because that was my first one. For me, it was a high because I had never been there before. Stanford, the second Super Bowl was my first Super Bowl, so I didn't know what to expect. I just want to make sure everything's ready, as in every game, but definitely this one because you're on national TV, international TV, whatever. I want to make a difference, not, not to have anything I do affect the game, except in a good way. I was there for the second, third, fourth, and fifth. We need one here, Bronco. I think you'll get one. I think they'll be the third organization behind the Patriots and Steelers to have six Super Bowl trophies in their case. I am nervous just wearing these. <laughs> it was heavy. Can we was check it really your fingers? Yeah. Did you take one home? I, no. For the record, I returned them. I made sure I videotaped <laughs> that. I returned it back. Where does he keep them? Did he, did, did he say? Safe deposit. Safe box. deposit. Yeah. But smart. Yes. Smart guy. In his yeah. sock drawer. And Just that kidding. last one. <laughs> and that last one he got was yeah. the last time. The Niners won it all. Absolutely. Yeah. And think about it. He was there for the senior, for McCaffrey senior, mm -hmm. and when Shanahan was 15 at the time. I know. So Incredible. He's just hoping the father-sons get the duo of the rings. That would be so cool. Awesome artifacts. Right. Yeah, yeah Love that. really cool. Thank you, Bronco, for sharing that. I don't have the rings.